I'm Kyrie Stokes, and this is Keyboard Exchange International. enjoy when Mr. Kyrie Stokes visits our store in Sanford, Florida. I just love his playing and I hope that you will also. He'll be back in just a few moments, but we wanted to use this time to encourage uh, some more of you to come and visit, play our instruments. Pastors, if you'd like to give a brief uplifting message and be backed up by a Hammond organ while you're giving that message, we very much encourage that. Just give us a call, make an appointment so we can have our camera crew ready. But uh, we very much encourage musicians and pastors, and if you're uh, a vocalist and you'd like to come along with your musician, feel free to do so. Let's have some fun here at Keyboard Exchange International. Without further ado, let's get back to Mr. Kyrie Stokes. <laughs> Thank you. 
Tyreek, I could listen to you play all day. Oh, and man. this video, when I'm at home, I'm going to be listening to it quite often, oh, I promise you. I just love the way you play. Thank you, Thank you so much for being here today. And uh, Tyreek's been playing on a 1955 uh, Hammond B3. Tyreek, did you know that 1955 was the very first year that B3s were manufactured? Wow, I didn't know that. So this is from the first year of manufacture. And we did a previous video some time ago where we removed the original tube preamp and installed a brand new solid state preamp with tone control adjustments, which also in that preamp gives you that reverb. I, I saw you were pretty much digging that reverb effect, weren't you? Love it. So I think uh, Randolph refers to this organ as something that we've kind of souped up. And uh, if you wanted a little more mids or a little more highs or a little more bass, you take the back off and you can tweak those adjustments, EQ it to your personal you know, specifications. One of the reasons that Kyrie is here today, uh, in addition to uh, helping us demonstrate this fine B3, is we're starting a new program where we're inviting church musicians to come and pick out an organ for their personal use at home. In fact, he's brought a friend uh, with him today who's also a church musician. And there are times, Kyrie, when church musicians get frustrated not having a good instrument to practice on at home. But even more so, if a church isn't willing to make the investment to get a fine instrument. So, what we're going to suggest, and I would like your opinion, is when a musician is playing in a church, but the church, they're very conservative, understandably so. They want to be wise stewards of the church's money. We all understand that. But if they've never heard what a significant difference a Hammond B3, C3, or A100 can make in their church, they just don't know. So what I'm thinking is if we, if we sold organs to musicians and they took their personal instrument to church, it would eliminate their frustration and it would give the people of the church the opportunity to really appreciate one of these fine instruments. Right. Do, you, do you think that would be a good I idea? that would work. You know, um, like you said, a lot of people just don't know. So if they heard the instrument and how it would enhance the service, then of course they would be tempted or persuaded to move on it and get one for themselves. Okay, well thank you for confirming my theory. Because we're going to try this. If you're a musician and you're playing at your church, or several churches maybe, but there's one church that you're playing at that just simply doesn't have an inspir inspiring type of instrument. I mean, let's face it, even Kyrie won't sound as good as he sounds on an inferior kind of an instrument. So what we're trying to do is reach out to the musicians who would like to have a better instrument in their life at the church they play for, but if the church trustees and pastor are not quite ready to make the commitment, let us help you demonstrate a fine instrument in the church while you're buying the instrument for yourself. And everybody, I think, benefits. So with Keyboard Exchange, the financing is easy, the delivery, the setup. Call for more details, but Harry, could you take us out with a grand finale of anything you'd like to play? Thank you so much for being here today.
Hi, I'm Jim Huss, speaking with you from the showroom at Keyboard Exchange International. We'd like to thank all of you who have helped us grow our business for the past 51 years, and it is our intent to find good homes for all the instruments we have gathered uh, from all over the United States. Thank you to the families that have preserved the instruments and then sold them to us, knowing that we would find good homes for them. If you, on the other hand, are in need of an instrument, please give us a call. Uh, there's been a lot of effort to gather these instruments together, and we would like to make you part of the Keyboard Exchange International family. Let's all work together to keep these fine instruments going long into the future so that we now and future generations can continue to enjoy the wonderful sound of the Hammond Tone Wheel Organ. God bless. Signing off.